Good. Welcome to our monthly recollection. I thought I could give a couple ideas on, on what a recollection is for those who haven't made one before, or just some practical reminders on how to, on how to make a good recollection online. So it can be helpful to think of a recollection like a mini retreat. And perhaps we're familiar with what a retreat is. It's a time of prayer, an extended time of prayer in silence, where we, we firstly pray, and then we examine ourselves, examine our conscience, and then we try to be converted. And so that's what we're going to try to do today, but only for about an hour and a half in this case. And so this is a custom that we live in Opus Dei, and we try to do it once, once a month, and, and that's very beneficial, right, in our own interior struggle. So right now we're in the library, but most of the recollection you'll see is going to take place in the chapel, which makes sense because we said that this is going to be like a long period of prayer. So the priest will give us two meditations, and it can be, it can be helpful to think of ourselves as a protagonist in, in that meditation, right? That the priest is saying ideas, but we're very much um, trying to use those ideas for our own prayer as material for our own conversation with Christ. So uh, to, not, to not to view this as some kind of passive uh, lecture, but it's, it's part of the, the retreat, so to speak. And then um, there will also be one talk given by a layman, and that will be on some practical aspect of the Christian faith. And maybe for, for that talk, we can go into it looking for one or two resolutions that we want to pull from it and then, and then um, make as our resolution to, to struggle on in the coming month. There's some, there's some time in between the, the talks and the meditations, um, but this isn't intended just to be sort of a gap in the program, but this, this quiet time in between the talks is very much part of the recollection, right? That, that, that we, we have scheduled this, this quiet time so that we can pray, and um, we've provided some text that you can, that you can reference and, and read to sort of enkindle your own prayer uh, throughout the duration of the recollection. There will be, in one of those quiet periods in between things, we, we will actually read an examination of conscience and so, um, so that's a very special part of the, of the recollection to, to sort of examine, um, examine ourselves in some more poignant questions of the spiritual life. We've also made the, the recollection available as a audio file. Um, so if, 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 if the video is distracting you know, for your prayer or it's not helping you pray, then, then great. Maybe you find it more helpful to, to just listen to it um, or go for a, a walk in a, a quiet place if it's a nice day, whatever. The point being is, is trying to, we're trying to pray here, so um, whatever is most beneficial to you. So that is the audio file is also on the website. And then a last idea here is that um, you know, making a recollection and praying can actually be difficult, right? You know, to, to talk with our Lord uh, is, is difficult. And on the human level, one strategy or one um, human thing that will really help us live this recollection well is silence, right? So if we live this exterior silence, it, it, it creates that interior space where we can enter into prayer with our Lord. So, so we, can, we can sort of um, take a moment at the beginning of the recollection to, to prepare for a successful recollection and, and sort of set the groundwork. So Maybe that means letting our roommate know, hey, for the next hour and a half, I'm going to be trying to do this recollection so he, so he knows not to come in and disturb us, or putting the phone on silence, or finding the right room in the house that's quiet. We know what we need to do, but it's good you know, at, the, at the beginning of the recollection to think, mm, how, right? how am I going to live silence so that I can try and enter into conversation with our Lord this recollection. So thank you, and enjoy the recollection.